Hi everyone, my name is Yanni, and today for our English story time, we'll be reading a book called If You Give a Pig a Pancake by Laura Numeroff. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you for joining me, and let's get started. If you give a pig a pancake, she'll want some maple syrup to go with it. You'll give her some of your favorite maple syrup. Can we pretend to pour some maple syrup? This is your bottle of maple syrup. You're going to pour it all over your pancakes. And then you're going to have to spread it around. She'll probably get all sticky. So she'll need to take a bath. Can we pretend to be all sticky on our hands? My hands are all sticky from the maple syrup. She'll ask you for some bubbles. When you give her the bubbles, she'll probably ask you for a toy. You'll have to find your rubber duck. The duck will remind her of the farm she was born. She might feel homesick and she'll want to visit her family. She'll want you to come too. She'll look through your closet for a suitcase. She'll look under your bed. Can we pretend to look under the bed? This is our bed. I'm going to look under. What's under the bed? Hmm. When she's under your bed, she'll find your top shoes. She'll try them on. She'll probably need something special to wear with them. When she's all dressed, she'll ask for some music. You'll play your very best piano and she'll start dancing. Can you pretend to play piano? Can you pretend to dance? She'll want you to take her picture. So you'll have to get your camera. Can we pretend to take a picture? When she sees the picture, she'll ask you to take more. She'll want to send one to each of her friends. You'll have to give her envelopes and stamps. Can we pretend to stamp our envelope? This is our stamp. We're going to stamp our envelope. And you'll take her to your mailbox. On the way, she'll see a tree in your backyard. She'll want to build a tree house. So you'll have to get her some wood, hammer, and nails. Can we pretend to hammer in the wood? This is our hammer. This is our wood. We're going to hammer in the nails. When the tree house is finished, she'll want to decorate it. She'll ask for wallpaper and glue. When she hangs the paper, can we pretend to hang the paper up? So we're going to put up the paper on the wall and you're going to use the glue to stick it on. It's a lot of glue. She'll get all sticky. And feeling sticky will remind her of her favorite maple syrup. She'll probably ask you for some. And chances are, if she asks you for some maple syrup, she'll want a pancake to go with it. Thank you for joining me today in reading the story, If You Give a Pig a Pancake. I hope you enjoyed it just as much as I did. In this story, we met a little friend that was a pig, and we helped the pig feel right at home because we gave everything that they wanted and we shared everything that we had with them. So the story will really teach your children to share with others and with their friends and families, no matter who they are. This author writes a lot of different stories similar to this one. I hope you enjoyed this a lot, and if you're interested, you can find other stories like this one to read to your children. Thank you, and I look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care. Bye.